back off mate, that is all good. What a night that was. I tell you what, you're not going to believe this. Look where we are. Sure. 10 to 8 in the morning. We're at Dunbar. Right, today's challenge is this. We've got to go and play golf somewhere else. Now we're in, you ready, East Lothian. And everyone who vlogs have done East Lothian and they've all done all the great courses, North Berwick, the Glen, Renantos. Today, we're going to do something different. We're going to play a Winterfield Golf Club. No one's heard of it, no one goes playing it. Is that a mistake? Well, I don't know. Only one way to find out is pack up and get gone. But, come here, this is where I slept last night. So here's our truck golf mates, and this comes down, and that's where I were, and that was my view this morning. So golf mates, we're on our way to Winterfield Golf Club, and we're just going to go straight through Dunbar because it's on the other side. And look at that there, Dunbar is absolutely beautiful, proper little fishing town. Now the reason we're going here is this, very simple, it's nearby. It's just, just, I've never heard of it, and I thought if I'm doing these trips, it'd be nice to show you courses where you've not seen. And, and like I said earlier on, when I was having a cup of coffee, it's easy to show you the courses where everyone's been to. So I've never been to this. So sit back, relax, and let's see what Winterfield Golf Club's like. Right, golf mates, we're going to be honest to you. As you've seen us driving in, it's a bit later in the day. We've come back, it's witching hour. We've gone for that perfect light. This place is amazing. Wait till you see this, but also as a massive giveaway. See the truck we're in? From Red Lion Rentals, there's a massive giveaway. We're giving it for a weekend. Yes, for two of you for a weekend, you've got this bad boy. Right, golf mates, they've told me where to play, and we're going to start off on this par three. And when I show you it, you're going to do this. Wow, wow, wow. And you might hear Joe go, wow, Liam, you've gone in the sea. Oh, and by the way, disclaimer, yesterday's video at the Dunbar, that was the North Sea, not the Firth of Forth. Golf mates, so we're here, 14th hole, called the point. Look at that, if the tide were in, it'd be crashing here. Par three, 190 yards, Bass Rock, it's famous in East Lothian. Are you ready? Like I said, that is the North Sea. So I'm gonna play three holes, I'm gonna play this par three, Par four with a beautiful view, and then an interesting par four. I'm going for. I'm going to par them all. That's all I'm saying. I want to par them all. I'm going to play off the yellows, and like I said, I've done something today. I'm not going to tell you, but I want to par them all. But are you ready? Again with the weather. I come to Scotland. The sun comes out. You need to adopt me. You need to adopt me. Hawkeye the new Harrison. Right, golf mates. Got five iron. I'm going to start it a tad left and let the wind bring it in. It needs proper hit here. I'm not going to start it on Bass Rock, but it won't be far off. What a little place. And wait till I tell you, you're looking at this hole. This golf course, Winterfield, is £30 all year. And if you're over 60, £19. I'd pay £30 to play this hole and the holes I'm going to show you. Anyway, five iron. Sun's out again. This is going great. Come on. Right wind. Oh, the wind's not. But jo, 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 zoom in, Joel. No. Hey, stay there. What a golf shot that. Do you know what? Sometimes they say when you hit them well and the sound was well, I know that because what's happened today, I know that they didn't go well. In fact, if the wind would have took that, that would have been on the green and would have bounced forward. Right, what I do know is this. Stint meter, these are about 11. These are fast as anything for Lynx greens, let me tell you. <laughs> right, I've got 58. Or 54. Problem I've got, I need to get it high. I'm going to have to go 58. This is a Vodafone shot. High tariff. This is really tricky, this. But, it's a not bad shot, that. It's just the wind didn't do it. And I fluffed it. I fluffed it. Actually caught the ground first. But I tell you what, what a hole, what a hole. Come over here, look at this, you'll love it. So Bass Rock, where Wyatt's famous, I don't know if I've said in a previous video, 
it's white when the sun's on it. And Joe said, has someone gone on and painted it? I said, Joe, no. It's all the seagulls and penguin droppings. That's why it's white. Anyway, got a par putt. Uh, it was a hard shot, that. It, links for 58s is not what you want to be doing. Right, uphill. Come on. Come on. Let's get this party started. Oh! Black eyed peas, let's get this party started. See this? See this? Take your time on these. So we do need a birdie. Right. Four. Right, a bogey, but does it matter? No. Right, golf mates, also on this course, which has got to be the best value in the UK, that is what you get for 30 quid. Now, I've brought you on this hole for two reasons. One, it's beautiful. Three, I've got to hit some sort of fairway, so I'm laughing here. So we've got driver in hand. I'm going to start at a tad left and let the wind bring it in. That is the plan. Let the wind be my friend. And the wind is definitely my friend there. I've nailed that. Let's see how far it goes. It's gone that far. I don't know where it's landed. Look at the sun. What is it with Scotland? Honestly, Harrison of the McHarrison clan. Need a birdie, get back going. Listen, what I am going to say here, such friendly, friendly people. Everyone I've met have been so friendly. Met some golf mates, even the pro, he didn't know who we were. Now he's a golf mate and he's laughing what's something happened today, but that video will be coming soon. Golf mates, I don't know why I've gone all David Attenborough and that, but honestly, I've took the camera off Joe. And I, I'm trying to think, why do I always come to Scotland? And sometimes I can say this, it's never windy on me and the sun always shines. So I think Scotland doesn't have wind and it's sunny all the time. But look at that, 12th, 13th, 14th of November or something like that. What a driver, what a drive. Winterfield Golf Club is, you ready, a par 65. It's got seven par threes, but, but there's about four or five of them over 200 yards. And I'll show you now, I'll show you now. That is the first hole. It's got the hardest hole in golf for starting. 237 yards, down a valley, uphill. Par three, par three. But what a hole, what a course, what views. It's just 30 quid. Come here and play this course. Definitely. Do Dunbar and do here. Stay in Dunbar. Great. It's a great place, honestly. It's a great place. Right, golf mates, look at that. We're as big as I thought. I think the, I think the hole was 300 yard, I think. I can't remember. I'm just in one of them today. I'm just playing golf in beautiful scenery. Right, left to right. Probably got about 70. I've got my 54. Give this a whack and let it bounce. So I think left of the green, well, pain I meant, and that should be the one. All right. I said left of the green. What about short left? Oh, got it. Last minute, it took the nose dive. Let's see, is it the damn buster? Will it roll down to the pin? Probably not. Will it be on the green? I hope so, because I pulled that one. That was a, a snatchy one. Right, golf mates, here we go. Pin high, but too much left. And I'm going to tell you a secret now. There's fast and fast, and this is not nice. This is very slippery. We're going to call this a politician. Slippery, slimy thing. Yeah, I've only just touched that. Gone. Look at that. Oh, it's, oh, slow down, slow down. I'll take that. You see how fast that was? Look at this. Yeah, people having a nice stroll. Love this witching hour, really do. Right. Inside right, I have to be firm. It's like I'm birdie in the last hole. Shoom, shakalak. Why is the sun out? Just people from Scotland who have watched the channel for a long time. Every time I go to Scotland, just tell me why. Why is it always sunny? and hardly windy. It's amazing. Scotland should be in the med. Right, golf mates, this hole's got a funny name, but it ties in with the hole well, and I'll tell you that down the fairway, but all you need to know is this. On one over, it's 370 yards, and it's having the driver. I've been hitting this all right this afternoon. Okay, it's got a little cut, so I'm gonna keep with it.
Oh, I've just hit, that's probably my best today. That, no zoom in, that is long, long, long. Love these, and there's no carding around that. got absolutely smoked. So, come with me, and I'm gonna tell you all about the name of this hole. Right, golf mate, so this hole, as you can see here, there's a wall going all the way around, all the way around, and it's called Promenade, the hole. But this, as you can see with the drone footage, it's like a walkway that goes all the way down to the town. It's class, but the views are spectacular. I'm gonna get this hole played, and I'm gonna, we're gonna peep over the wall. Hopefully when we peep over the wall, we don't get shot. Right, golf mates, 110 to the pin. Don't go big. Well, you could go big, it might hit the wall and come back. Problem is now, I'm in between 110. I'll be honest, played this earlier on and he had 182 in, but never mind. No, it's 110. So I've got a gap wedge. I said I want a birdie. Well, let's have a birdie putt. That could be the perfect number if it checks. Go on. I said check, I didn't want it check. I thought that were perfect. That was good. I, I'm happy with that, straight as a die. And it's on the green. Try and make the putt, if not a two putt, and then we're gonna peek over the wall, like I said, and hopefully nothing bad happens. We had nice fish and chips last night. Mm. I think we're gonna find a pub and go in there. Do you know what, I'll take you with us tonight, I'll take you with us. Right, golf mates, one thing in Scotland, you have a lot of castles, but you have a lot of stately homes and states. I don't know what that is, but look at it perching on that hill there, it's massive. I mean, I don't know what it's got to do with golf, but uh, look at this, checked up, lovely. There's one releasing a bit more. Right, that's why I played this all, is because what we're, we're gonna play, you know, if you've got kids, you play peekaboo. We're gonna peekaboo over that wall in a minute. But for a birdie, which I'll, uh, I'll be fond of a birdie, but a two putt be good. But also, also the giveaway, I forgot to mention it. Just comment, here it is, Red Lion Rentals, and you're in the draw for win for the weekend, you and your mate, the Volkswagen Transporter. And Joe, is it comfy? Very. Right, come on. It's not bad. It weren't exactly a birdie putt. I were exaggerating the truth to try and get a birdie. But I don't think Mr. Barlow will give me that, so I'll pop her in and then we'll go peeky boo. Boom shakalak. Come on, I said this, didn't I? So you might. I don't know if Joe's tall enough. There's a, there's a little hole of it. Forget that, Joe. So this is why I come to Scotland. It's for that. How nice is that? Eh? Beautiful. Look at that, talking of castles, there's an old remained one there, Joe. See it with the flag and everything. So it's just beautiful, now you've got to look at me. Anyway, back to the van, get some dinner. Let's find out where we're going to sleep tonight and uh, get to the pub. And uh, you ready? Have some nice food. Right, golf mates, we're on a little journey. I'm going to give you a secret, but we've just gone past this castle. You'll see the drone now, it's called Tantalan Castle. And uh, absolutely, you can see us driving in, and we got waved away by the security guard. You can't put your drone here. Didn't listen to it, beautiful, isn't it? Absolute beautiful. So golf mates, we're, on, we're finding somewhere to stay tonight, but this is what happens. There's a peak there, you'll see now, and it reminds me, that is near a golf course called the Glen, I'm positive. So it brings back memories. I did a video years ago with some golf mates, Barry Edwards, Rob Potter, and Sam Townsend. And it's a great course. So if I can get there, I'm gonna get the drone up and show you, I mean, look at this coastal road. And you know me, you just, like, you just know I like being free, traveling where I want and doing things different. So this is all off spec. It's a nice spot, we could sleep there tonight, there's some there, but uh, beautiful road, this beautiful. Anyway, I'm gonna try and get to the Glen and show you the Glen. It's got some gorgeous holes. Golf mates, it's just as I remembered it, coming down to the Glen, which is in North Berwick. We have got North Berwick, but we've got the Glen here. You'll see it in a minute. Beautiful clubhouse right on the front. And when I get the drone up, you'll be like, wow. Interesting fact, the Glen, it's a municipal. And I'm gonna call it today, it is the best municipal I have ever played by a mile. Look at the clubhouse here, look at the writing. Look at it, beautiful. 1906, oh yes. Let's get out. Golf mates, I had to show you this, it's like an Alan Wicker. Right, there's the clubhouse at the Glen. 
the 18th sir you tee off down but look that's north berwick beautiful place across sir is north berwick golf club but but here's the links here at the glen bass rock it's not white at the moment because the you know the light's going down but if i can get the drone up you'll see from now there's a par three down there what's beautiful anyway let's get this drone up mate so that's why i love scotland anyway the glen i told you i like it i just know your answer anyway we're not stopping there we told you we're going to the pub for some food and you're coming with us right golf mates we found a pub we're on Cullen's kink and then we're on some you ready some wellington i think pork and black body in wellington but i'm gonna give you a tip we're near gullen but we're not playing gullen Stay tuned for tomorrow, find out where we are.